Hi, I'm Osiri Wisdom. Welcome to day 52 of 100 Days of Wisdom. So we are in a new series, Hearing the Voice of God. So yesterday we mentioned that the voice of God, the voice of devil, the voice of human beings, the voice of different kinds of voices, there is no voice without significance. So number two reason why you need to hear the voice of God is that God will not only give you direction, but that God has put what it takes for your life to be directed, not in you, <laughs> but within himself. He still holds, look at what he says in the book of Jeremiah chapter 10 and verse 23. He said, Lord, I know that people's lives are not their own. It is not for them to direct their path. You know, that means what it takes for you to direct your path, God has not kept in you. In fact, in the same Jeremiah 33 and verse 3, the message translation, it says, Call on me and I will show you things you can never figure out on your own. You could never, you can never figure out on your own. So you see that no matter how sharp a man's brain is, there are things you cannot figure out on your own. You know, that's why people that are inventors, they are very close to God. They, they know that they, they need an inspiration from God to inspire them to be able to produce the kind of result either to solve you know, a sickness or to handle a particular invention. They are looking for a superior insight that can cause them to rise and be able to win. That's what God does for us. That's what God opens you up. And that's the privilege you have in being able to come to God and say, God, you know what? Direct my part. Lord, guide me. You know, the thing is that man needs to get to that point where they understand, where we all understand, that God wants to specifically guide you. And God has done that all over. God can give you direction in specific areas in your business, in your career, in your marriage, in even in, in, the, in the church to worship in, you know, a city to live in, God can specifically guide you that. He has a lot of specific direction. In fact, he says in the book of Jeremiah, Isaiah 30 and verse 21, he said, if you, if you wander off the road to the right or to the right, to the left, he said, you will hear a voice saying, this is the way walk in there and follow it. So God does not just want you to choose any way. God can also give you specific truth, specific instruction. He had done that several. He can even give you somebody's name to meet. He can tell you the number of the street to go to. I pray may your spiritual antenna open up. In this season, the solution to the things that you are looking for is your capacity to hear the voice of God. I cherish you and I value you.